to stay focused. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. There goes MP, the most hyped prospect since LeBron James. Can this third generation NBA athlete and 19 year old superstar live up to the hype? The journey begins tonight as he plays his first NBA game. Deja vu in here. <laughs> no, right. It's not every day you see his son playing his first NBA game. I know I shouldn't be focused on this, but I still can't believe that Grandpa's not here right now. It just doesn't feel right. It's okay to feel that way. I miss him too, but you know, Grandpa would kick you behind if he knew you let him distract you like that. <laughs> you gotta put that on the back burner, huh? Yeah, you're right. Now listen to me, there are gonna be a lot of people in here tonight. For it all these years. Greatness. I don't care about the hype. Most of the people talking, they don't even believe what they say half the time. But me and you believe. Yeah. What do we believe? That I could be one of the best players to ever play this game. Yes, sir. That starts tonight. What is good with y'all, boys? You're doing a big game tonight, kid. Hey, Talk. MP, what's up? Check out these free kicks that we're hooking you up with. Uh, wonder if the NBA Finals, I can do that. Uh, excuse me. Of Jordan, I'd like to wish you good luck in your first. Hey, MP, let's talk for a minute. Get me ready for this since I was six years old, so I'm ready. Okay, so that's what it takes. I'm pretty sure y'all done singing those. Big hops right there, right, right, and then let's see. Have a 95 dunk. Don't ask how. <laughs> I might have or might have not spent. My VC. Hold up. All right. Welcome, everyone. Here it is at long last. It's the start of the NBA regular season. I know everyone's just as excited as we are here yeah, on right, 2K so Sports to get right. things underway. Brian Anderson here. With me tonight are analysts Richard Jefferson and Grant Hill. And our reporter, Holly LaForce. So let's take a look at the starters for the Philadelphia 76ers. Paul Reed is out there with Tobias Harris. Then there's Kelly Oubre. What do you mean that's Kyle a foul? Lowry, and it's Maxi in at the two. Course. And tonight, the first game of MP's career. Of a lot of eyes watching to see how his journey begins. Well, many believe that MP is the next face of the NBA. I mean, he comes from a long line of NBA talent. Father Prince and Grandfather Truck both had strong careers. I know this is one of the most anticipated debuts in years. Opening day of the regular season, Grant. Nothing quite like this first of the year. You know, as a former player, you know firsthand that there's so much anticipation and hard work that goes into making it to opening day. So everyone right now is on a level playing field, and the dream is still alive. Now, here is James. Lillard outside. Green. The shot's good on the assist by James. 
Lillard gets so much lift on his three pointers. It's almost effortless. How they he have shoots. Kyle. Wow. And just over a minute played here to start the game. Here's Lowry. The Sixers with another miss. For Milwaukee, they've gone two of three from the floor. The shot by James, no good. For Philadelphia, they've gone 0 for 3 from the floor to begin this one. Up top, Maxi. Defended by Lillard. Pass to Reed. Oubre against Middleton. Ooh, and he took a hard foul on the shot. Okay. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. It's going to be on Bobby Portis. Man, he made sure to get his money's worth on that foul. And he knocks down the first one. Lots of winning going on in Philadelphia. Six straight playoff appearances. Richard. Only a 34% yeah, the chance. Game, that's just the way it is. No finals appearances. And look, that's got to be top of mind. East is tough, but they've got the talent to go far, but they just keep having mid-seasons. Pass to James. Back to Lillard. Jacks up a three. Three. Nails it from three. Lillard's got six. And that's a veteran move by Lillard to see the D closing and get the shot away. And here is Maxi. Out to Oubre. Three-pointer. Anadokounmpo grabs the board. Oh, for four to start things off. Got a bit of a pillow fight brewing here. But they're going to get it going. And showing the point guard instincts there. Boy, Giannis can make it look easy. Philadelphia has gone 0 for 2 from outside. James against Maxi. Just over two and a half minutes played here in the first. And here's Harris outside. Can't get it to go. Making him 0 for 2. I mean, just a tough start. Missing their first five shots. It's stolen away. For three, Maxi. And that comes off the assist by Lowry. Now that's confidence right there. This is when you know Maxi is feeling it. For three, I'm popping at three. This what? I full body in it. He just looks off this quarter. It looks like he's forcing it a bit right now. A little bit in his head. Wow, you talk about expectations from a rookie. Grant MP came into the league with a shoe deal already in place. And plenty of cachet being a Jordan brand athlete. As if he needed any extra. But I'll tell you, he looks good with that Jumpman logo. Well, Grant, how do the Bucks put the pieces back together and make a run at another title? Well, the hope is this new coaching staff will unlock some new wrinkles and find ways to keep their offense from stalling in the clutch. He gives up a bit of size at the center position, but his leaping ability, well, let's just say that makes up for it. Pass to James. Philadelphia grabs You're, the miss. Bruh. Reed's this game is selling he bro. Middleton covering. Why am I not getting contacts? Always like, quick to strike Maxi I know how to use my meter. Pulls the trigger. Milwaukee calls okay. timeout. Can I please use the meter? A different look for Milwaukee. Or is there just something against the meter? No. How are we still only up one? What? And with a pause Yard. in the action, yeah. here we have the best rebounding teams from last year. Number one, the Bucks. Last year, this was a team that owned the paint. They were so committed to rebounding. And that's a stat you love to lead the league in. Payne against James. Bro, what? Payne with the bucket. Payne's got four points this quarter. Got it in deep, and that's how you do it. Filling out the wings, it's Beasley and Middleton. Brooke Lopez is out there with Danilo Gallinari. And it's James in at the one. That's the five on the floor for the Bucks. He's got a knack for finishing inside. That's easy money. The Sixers trailing. Outside Payne. The two outside. Pass to Heel. Shot clock at five. Late clock. The Sixers need to put one up here. The shot by Payne. No good. Hey, sometimes the best looks don't equate to points. Beasley finds James. Philadelphia grabs the miss. 
Well, despite some uneven shooting from him, they're still out in front. And here's Harris outside. Gallinari pulls it in. And James has got the ball here for Milwaukee. And what you appreciate about Tobias Harris, the steady production, Richard. Yeah, he rarely has an off night. Even if the shot okay. isn't falling, he'll find other ways to help because he has a team-first mentality. They're searching for a way to score. Yeah, buckets have been very tough to come by. The Sixers with another miss. Well, some cribs you get the shot you want, it just doesn't fall. I'd go back to him in that area on the floor. Back to Beasley. Launches a three. The shot's good. Oh. Only assist by James. Come on James now. He's got his third assist of the night. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. Yeah, that just comes down to a lack of effort. The defender has to do a better job fighting through the screen. Now here's Heal. Still no points. What? And a foul on Brooke Lopez. That's his first foul. Damian Lillard's checked in for Milwaukee. The 76ers also with a sub. Oubre's checked in. And a little under two and a half minutes gone by here in the second quarter. Shot clock at six. Harris on the wing. Covered by Lopez. Harris misses. For Milwaukee, they've gone a terrific four of five here in the second quarter. All right, let's toss it over to the sideline for a report on MP. Thank you, B.A. Well, if you were curious just how hyped the NBA world is for MP's debut, just look at that crowd. Celebrities from all over are in attendance, and also his father, former player Prince, and those set of eyes are probably putting the most pressure on MP to perform, guys. A lot of big names out there, right? Thanks, Allie. Basket's good. Scoring close in. Heald is more than just a three-point gunner. The Bucks have gotten five of their first six attempts to fall in the second. James passes to Lopez. James outside. The three is up. That is break. And it's what is my charm shot, bro? This is, of course, their first opportunity to play Milwaukee this season. Yeah, we saw how combative yet enjoyable last season's series was. Two very excellent teams going at it. It's always a marquee matchup on the schedule. I think it's going to be another fun set of games between them this year. And, and even though Middleton doesn't pile up blocks, he has the link to disrupt shooters, and he did right there. And how about that replay? Man, you got to appreciate the hustle on defense. You know, you can't ask for any better defense than that. He responded so fast to the shooter, and it stifled him. And the Bucks with some changes. Anadokounmpo comes in for Chris Middleton, and it's Crowder in for Beasley. Four on the clock. Here's Harris. Rebounded by Lopez. Oh, man, he can't get anything to fall. You can feel his frustration. Yeah, <laughs> right now, he's just in his own head. Not much you can do to try and push through it. And it's the Sixers. How do you make that bounce like Six-point game. Maxi passes to Oubre. <laughs> Lowry surveys the D. Pass to Reed. From deep. Bro. The what? Sixers with another miss. And the defense got away with one there. I mean, that's a shot he typically makes. James finds what? Crowder. And here is Hanada Kumpo. Back to James. Hanada Kumpo, a screen uh -huh. on Maxi. And he lobs it up. Whoa! Oh, bro. Giannis, don't, 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 don't be doing that. Giannis hammer it home. Never a bad idea. Philadelphia has gone 0 for 2 from outside in the second quarter. And this summer, the Sixers making changes on the bench. Grant, the mission statement is clear. Make it past the conference semifinals. Oh, so clear, B.A. Mm -hmm. It's been the stumbling block in recent years. I'm not sure even that's good enough. This is a team with legitimate championship aspirations. And it's the Sixers with the ball. After the Bucks picking up a basket just moments ago, he gets it in there. Maxi's got 10 points in the game. What an adjustment by Maxi. That will be available. James against Maxi. James passes to Ana Kumpo. Against contact. Yana stays strong. Boy, absolutely no rim protection, leading to a lot of easy buckets here. Lowry against Lillard. There's a screen. 
outside Oubre from the arc. That's good. And so Lowry with the Oubre assist. making three for the first Lowry's time in forever. Was in the game. A title winning point guard, Kyle Lowry, making the right choice there. Now, here is James. Ten points for him. Pure from three point range. James has got 11 here in the quarter alone. Philadelphia has gone one of four from three point land here in the second. For three, Maxi. Rebounded by Lopez. Lopez has got a rebound number five here. Three. Tapping. Now Lowry goes up from the top of the key. Oh, what? he hits it at the buzzer. Great job ending the quarter on a high note. That's the play that pumps up the whole team, and they'll try to carry that energy into the next period. And that'll do it for the first half. That, that's play. kind of crazy. The Bucks on I top. Missed, They're up uh, by eight. And we'll be back for the second bar. half following the break. Keep it right here on 2K Sports. And you have to admire MP's confidence as a rookie. Tip off the old blocks. Both his dad and his granddad had great belief in themselves. The difference with MP, he's one of the best prospects we've ever had. And now we look back at the first half. Guys, some adjustments needed for the Philadelphia 76ers. Yes. Thanks for tuning in. Now You're welcome. And we've got third quarter basketball here. Two quarters in the books. Probably all she did was on that tricycle. Like, wait. Uh. The Sixers trailing. Second half underway. Uh. Here's who Nick Nurse has got on the floor. Kyle Lowry out there with Maxi. Then it's Paul Reed. Then there's Tobias Harris. And it's Oubre in at the small forward position. All right, RJ, let me put you on the spot. In the not so distant future, let's say 2028, who's the face of the NBA? Well, NBA, there's a high probability LeBron might still be playing, but my smart money is on Luca. He's already a superstar. Oh, maybe it's Victor Rabinyama. I saw, I saw. We've never seen a guy that can do what he does at his size, but I can't wait to find out. Here's James. After the Sixers picked up a basket a moment ago, and so he draws Bro, the foul headed mean? to the line to shoot a pair. And here's what the Milwaukee Bucks like schedule that. looks like. On Sunday, they'll be playing against Clint Capella and the Atlanta Hawks. And then on Monday, they'll be matching up with Jimmy Butler and the Miami Heat. I have to really suck to not be able to hit on one. The there we go. <laughs> the 76ers shooting around 39%. They'd like to get that higher. Lowry, the pass to Oubre. To the paint. Here's Reed. Second chance shot. Giannis Antetokounmpo grabs the board. Antetokounmpo has got six rebounds in the game. James inside. He's guarded by Lowry. Shots <laughs> good by James. <laughs> Looks like we're starting to see a pattern here. Not afraid to get in the paint and get wet. Oh, my God. Outside Maxi. Why? And that comes off the I mean, I guess, but like, why would you Lowry's do this? Like, Shit. The, the pure shooting stroke of Maxi gifted at draining it from <laughs> outside the arc. Timeout call. Milwaukee. Shut it. What? And if you want to know which players had the most success from distance last season, here they are. Fifth, Tyrese Maxi. He shot with nearly unmatched confidence from the arc last year. And the numbers and his position on this list clearly reflect that. And slam dunk by James. And I Come love on the balance for Lillard between scoring and passing. That so that's time, finding his that's teammate. 26. What did Jordan have? 36. Okay, I guess I could get Jordan. Most likely Jordan. Great look. Always ahead of steam, Richard. Tyrese Maxey is so electric. You never know what he's going to bring. B.A., he loves to get out in transition and run. Speed is his greatest asset in what speed kills. Oh, my honest. I got you with this. His this lob. Now, here is James. Uh -huh. 18 points for him. Got to appreciate the decisiveness of Giannis. Rolling with purpose after setting the screen. 
And we're just about two minutes into the second half now. The 76ers have gotten two of four shots to go since the break. Maxi against James. Pass to Lowry. Six on the shot clock. Takes a three. James with the rebound. And so it's James with it. He brings it up for the Bucks. Ten-point lead. This is their biggest of the game. And let's go courtside. There's some news on MP. Hey, Brian, MP is one of the most highly regarded prospects of all time. And the oh, my God. To succeed is huge. Basketball fans across the globe Straight are tuning up. in to the debut of MP. Long it. And on stage. Oh. On a show to live up to. Let's see. The hype. That's even possible at this I point. I scored a guys. three. Yeah, he's looking 30. to make a splash, isn't he? Signing nine points. And Philadelphia has possession. Following the score by Milwaukee. Nice rebound. Trying to match the other team's intensity right now. Oh my god. I'm tough. Uh, Tiffany, I'm tough. 13 points in the game. To stop the run. To, to stop what run? Kupo's got his eighth rebound here tonight. Good. James has got nine points now in the quarter. Oh, the cool. ball movement on this run has been tremendous. It's led to a lot of good, clean, open looks. Bruh, I was like, call time here. Have and he hasn't got anything to go. You can see the frustration <laughs> as a result. His team, not in great shape either. I am really tough. I need to hide. And the Bucks making a change here. No, Tanner. It's not meant for this whole thing. Buddy Hill, bad catch is work. So muddy. The Bucks shooting has been great. 57% and finding ways to score consistently. Danilo Gallinari out there with Malik Beasley. Then there's Damian Lillard. Then there's Brooke Lopez. And it's James in a shooting guard. That's the group for Milwaukee right now. Bruh. Look at Heald's unselfish approach. He's you really let that happen, not too. Not just himself. Oh, my God. Pass to Lopez. Back to James. Hello. Gallinari with a screen on heel. Here's James. Jesus. And it's I need to upgrade that mid. Rebound. Following this Have game, they hit the road road. to challenge the Raptors at Scotiabank ah. Arena in Toronto. That'll wrap up this short two-game road trip. Bamba finds Payne. Here's Heel. Checked by James. Now here's Payne. Bamba, the screen on Lillard. Here's Payne. Whoa. And he cuts it's over the two is Another crazy. shot right in the lane. That's been their M.O. this evening. He's going for the oop here. And so the ball out of bounds. Heel touch it last. Ha ha. Great Bruh, read I, to get a hand in there and disrupt the play. I would have yeah, had I think he was if, hoping to maybe even get this. If, but I agree. Agree. He still got a good outcome. Crowder, he's checked in for Beasley. The 76ers also with a sub. Okay, Maxi, he's checked in for I really did think it was going up the court. It was him down. against the four. Teamwork on that drive. Punctuated by a strong finish. Yeah, that's nice execution. Running with purpose and creating an easy scoring opportunity off the break. Now, here is James. He missed. Fuck. And it's Philadelphia with the rebound. Heald's got four rebounds in the game. Maxi on the wing. The three. Sends it home I mean, three-point land. Okay, bro. This dish is looking bad. Half, but you start to get the feeling he's finding his rhythm out there now. Yes. The shot by James. No good. He's okay, so like 6'3 six six and I'm 6'6. Six six. Period for him. It would be an understatement. But good hey, job, sometimes you bro. gotta shoot your way out of the slump. Even for him. Two They're making two smart two adjustments, two setting two guys two. up for success. But it took them a little while to get there. Just goes to like show as you persevere, you'll figure Try your way out. Try to get a block. Portis, he's checked in for Gallinari. Ubre, he's checked in for the Sixers. Lowry comes in for Payne. Here's James. Oh, you where's the foul? Where is the foul? God damn Where is the foul? Y'all really just didn't see it. Trump and then gets folded. Firing on all 
cylinders for them right now. Or am I just we'll like, they can keep it going. am I going crazy or something? Like, stop playing with me, bro. Very I'm cooling to game on y'all. Need what is it? Uh, 30. I need a three pointer. And here are the 76ers. Um, sorry? This run now up to 13 2. Back to Maxi. That's good. And so okay. Lowry with the assist. So? Lowry's got eight assists here tonight. <laughs> they are passing the ball around tremendously right now. Now, here is James. And the shot. Come on. Good. James has got 13 in the second half. Oh, such a close game. He's finally starting to help out. Only two for seven in the fourth quarter. And Maxie's got the ball here for Philadelphia. They trail by six. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. James against Maxie. Pass to Crowder. Here's James. Tries again. And a foul <laughs> called on the way up. So he'll take Bro. two from the free throw line. Two. It's going to go on. Just Maxie. The defense they're wow. doing whatever they can to protect the rim. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the there we go. are coming That's from not 36. The look, they're getting good Bruh. looks inside. It's been a point of emphasis yeah, all night long, but I love like like this hard-nosed attitude of this team. Well, something else that stands out is how they've shared the ball. I mean, they're getting a lot of their points from sharp passing. Anacumpo has checked in for the Bucks. Middleton comes in for Crowder. For Milwaukee, they've got two of eight shots to drop in the final quarter. And there's three from the arc. What? He grabs the miss. Reed's got his 16th rebound on the night. Here's Maxi. That one drops for him. Maxi's okay, got 20 cool. points. Attacking in a big moment. Maxi is not holding okay. Coming back. For three, James. Deal. Uh, how, what? How come I can almost make that? But I can't make a the fudge. To Lowry, pass to Reed. Lowry outside. He he made me jump, but like he didn't shoot. Picked by Reed. Just five to shoot. Lillard against Lowry. Good work defensively by Lillard. Flashes the bucket oh, like you expect him to make. It's tough when he missed that. Oh my god, what? He hasn't been able to find his touch this quarter. Yeah, straight up, guys. Like, he's ice cold. Like, okay. What's colder than cold? What? You don't have to shoot it, my guy. Well, like, it's ten okay to pass the ball. See, out. <laughs> it shot into a reverse. For three, Maxi. Kumpo grabs the board. Questionable shot selection in that three. Not really helping as they try Yo, to bro, the where are the fouls? Maxi again. Do I have 36? It's oh. Lillard. Right side, Maxi. Lowry outside. Ubre against Middleton. Just five on the clock. Reed, no good. Milwaukee's gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the fourth quarter to the middle. Here's Portis. Oh. Portis with the dunk. Just a textbook lead pass right there, putting it right where it needed to be. Now a timeout called by Philadelphia. Timeout. They trail by seven. Mm -hmm. 52 seconds left in the fourth they quarter. They could get seven. Let's go now to the sideline and catch up with Allie LaForce. Hey, I wouldn't be mad at him. I want Nick Nurse had to say to the team. He reminded his team just how close this game okay. is. Okay. Guys, we aren't um, out of this yet. We still have plenty of time okay. left. Okay, you could chill out, out though. Game plan, and I promise you, we will win this game. Let's see how they come out of this timeout, Brian. Y'all yeah, will win the game. They decide to foul intentionally. Forty-four seconds left in the fourth quarter. That's and an intentional foul right there. That's a miss. He doesn't Perfect. get the first one to fall. Trying to focus now for the second. And that trip going okay, up empty, bro. missing both. This play could decide the game. Can't afford any mistakes here, BA. Here's Maxi. Whoa. Iron and out. And so they choose to intentionally foul. Come on, Giannis. 
Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, foul shots aren't Giannis's strong suit, but here's no. his chance to show up the haters. Nah. And he does get the second one. And that puts him up five. Time for okay, the, the 76ers decide to talk it over. They're trailing by five. 29 seconds I'm left in the final quarter. Bonus <laughs> now five seconds separating the shot clock and the game clock. Maxi passes to Reed. Back to Maxi. And here's Ubre from the arc. Come on. Rebounded by the Bucks. They led the game by 20. And that's an intentional foul. <laughs> Put that dude. All the way. That's me. Oh, one. he and made it. And that increases the lead to six. That increases the lead. So he gets nice. a move, and it's a seven-point nice. game. Taking full advantage of his opportunities at the line to extend their lead. Hey, bro. No, no, no. no Harris no. outside. Let's go with a three. And connects from downtown. Just one word for you, and that is clutch. This guy, Harris, all he does is make plays. Yeah, you, know, you had to do that. I mean, you can't allow them to dribble out the time. Good on the first. And that puts him up five. 30. Oh. That's 41. And the second free throw. Damn, no good. Tough break there. And here's Lowry from the arc. And he cans that one. Oh, my God. And so it's Ooh. Milwaukee who scraped by with the win. What a performance they have here at home today. Oh, I'll tell you what. Wow, that's kind of crazy that Brady made that. <laughs> it's crazy, but it's not crazy. Because, like, that's not kind of Lowry. Yeah, that's 41. <sighs> okay. Alright. But we're gonna try to do this in an orderly fashion, all right? Uh, why don't we start uh, right over here? Gary Carson, local Gary. news. MP, Gary. you began your career with the most hype out of any NBA prospect since LeBron James. After playing a very respectable first game, that's all you put a box score numbers comparable with Michael Jordan in his debut. Have you made a statement here that the hype is real? about the team uh, no I don't think so that wasn't my mindset anyway I'm just trying to mess with my teammates I'll figure out how to contribute to winning and continue to work on my game I would never go out there and try to make a statement about me it's always us always thank you uh, next question right here right up front Oh, my God, you're on my God. No, no, no. no. Lena Becker, Sport Monthly. How does it feel to get your first win in an NBA game with fans watching all around the world? Wow. <laughs> it's great that the NBA is such a global game that we've got reporters here from. It's, it's Germany, right? Yeah. Wow, that's awesome. It's a sign that the game continues to grow and find fans around the world. That means there's a deeper talent pool, more exposure. It's exciting if you love the game. Uh, awesome. How do you say how do you say thank you in German? Dankeschön. 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 That's awesome. All right, we got time for one more. Uh, right in the back, right in the back. Damian Patterson, City Free Press. What does it mean to you to be a third generation NBA player, following in the footsteps of your father Prince and grandfather Chuck? And grandfather Chuck. 
um, it means a lot. Yeah. I mean, you got to respect where you come from. And I come from a line of guys who got basketball in their blood. <laughs> but the most important thing to me right now is representing these fans and uh, the city and bringing them the championship they deserve. As much as I love my dad and miss my grandpa, I play for the name on the front of the jersey, not on the back. Thank you. Next question. Uh, right up front. Parfait, merci. Beatrice Corbet, la compétition. Votre maillot est le maillot le plus vendu en France en ce moment. Avez-vous un message pour vos fans français? Beatrice Corbet, the competition. Your jersey is the number one selling jersey in France at the moment. Do you have any message for your French fans? <laughs> Love you guys. France is awesome. I went there to help promote my first shoe deal and I fell in love with the country. I mean, there's so much beautiful history there. But it's also very modern and forward thinking at the same time. I'd love to go back someday and spend some serious time there. Uh, thank y'all. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Good to see you. Thank y'all. <laughs> Proud of you, MP. Hey, you should be. I'm about to do something special with the family name. No? Level it up. You talk real big for somebody who just was crying as they dropped their uh, Ninja Turtle in the toilet. Pop, that was like 12 years ago. I'm a, I'm a grown man now. You can't even rent a car. That's why I got you. Uh -huh. And you're lucky that you do. Hey, I appreciate it, Pop. You're here to keep me on track. Uh -huh. You know what the goal is. Greatness. That's right. Oh, uh, speaking of, you know who this guy is. Yeah, what about him? Just updated his all-time GOAT list. Says that you have a chance to make it to the top someday. For real? Mm -hmm. Take a look. So with all this talk about MP being the best prospect since LeBron James and Victor Webinyama being a generational talent, it got me thinking about my all-time GOAT list. Now, if you are new to the pod, you might not know that I have a passion for ranking the legends. I spent a massive amount of time over. researching their careers, and I placed them in five tiers of greatness. Nah, I'm not messing with you, bro. people you want on your side if they're going to call you the GOAT someday. Oh, come on, pot. Look at he has LeBron over Kobe. See, in this, he hasn't scored for any K yet. But over Kobe? Four is over five. Any day. Hey, 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 be honest. Where's Kyrie? No. Practice. Um, two career trips. Oh, oh, that's it for this video. Hope y'all liked it. I'll catch y'all.